Hi, this is Jay from Merkland and this is a video of our Mercedes E-Class Tourer. Um, it's an E350 in black, 2013, and it's the newer model because there was a, a facelift in 2013. And this is the newer model of the vehicle, so comes with a lot of improvements uh, on, on the facelift. You can tell the uh, facelift model by the different design of the front end, the headlamps, the grille and everything. Um, it's a complete revision of the car. So overall this car is in very, very good condition. It's done um, 60... Um, how many thousand miles? 67,000 miles. Um, and the bodywork and everything is very, very good for that mileage. Um, the condition of the car is very, very good. Of course, at that sort of mileage you can expect the odd stone chip here and there, which uh, of course you'll expect to find with any used car but uh, overall I can't see any major dinks, dents or scratches on this car a few little stone chips on the bonnet uh, uh, sorry on the bumper and maybe a couple on the bonnet uh, which as I say you would expect there's nothing uh, that stands out too much wheels are all in good condition this car hasn't been through our preparation procedure yet uh, not fully anyway so it still needs a service um, inspection MOT, we'll check all the tyres, brakes, all that kind of thing, make sure that it, uh, the new owner doesn't have to spend any money on the car straight away. This is all part of our process here at Merkland. It's got the uh, privacy gate glazing from the factory, so tinted windows to you and me. You know when someone's looked after a car when it's got a boot liner in, uh, it's a genuine Mercedes boot liner, came with the car and of course underneath the carpet's uh, immaculate. Uh, these days you don't get a spare wheel or a jack or anything because it's um, you've got the add blue tank where the spare wheel used to go so you just get a pump up kit and, a, and a, some goo for putting in tyres which is in there uh, I would never dream of using that goo but uh, there you go that's another subject um, as I say the car is in very very good condition so I'll just take you uh, onto the interior now and uh, just show you some of the features of this vehicle Okay, simple over here, we've just got the window switches, folding mirrors, mirror adjustment. This car has a sat nav, uh, a standard, let's start the car, sat nav, a standard, heated seats, air conditioning of course, uh, DAB radio, okay, you can connect to this radio in various ways, um, a memory card, uh, Bluetooth, media interface cables, there's various ways of connecting to a car as you sort of expect with most modern cars nowadays. That was one of the things that improved a lot with the facelift. Um, the audio system's a lot better, um, you know, it's much more modern basically. Here's your media interface cables in here actually, you can see um, you get the ones for the USB, uh, old style iPod auxiliary, and you, there is a USB connection as well. Uh, we found that certain phones connect better to than others uh, to the uh, media interface, um, but uh, the Bluetooth audio uh, works perfectly, I've always found, and that's probably the best way to connect your music. Okay, um, what else do we have on here? So um, we've got the online sat nav, so if you connect your phone to it, the data will allow you to get online. Okay. Um, Apart from that, I think that's probably about it down here. You've got your electric tailgate switch, which uh, allows you to open the boot from inside. So if you're dropping the kids off to school, they can get their things, run off into school, and you can just close the, the tailgate remotely without having to leave your driving position. Over here, we've got the cruise control stalk, which is also a speed limiter. So you can set your cruise control um, as, as, as you'd expect, but also you've got a speed limiter function where it doesn't let you go above a certain speed. Of course, very useful in speed limiting areas, uh, speed to speed trap areas. Um, here, this is a multifunction stalk, which is classic Mercedes. You've got your wipers, um, main beam on there, and, uh, and rear wipers for an estate. And this is your gear selection. So down is drive up into neutral or up into reverse and park is just the push of this button okay so that's basically the features on the inside i'll just show you the engine for just in case anyone is interested in seeing a pl plastic engine cover uh, which is about all you see nowadays in an engine bay okay
Okay, so there we go. It has an engine, it's a V6, very smooth, very powerful. Uh, power plant these well uh, reliable that that uh, version of the engine has been out since what 2004 or 5 uh, the v6 diesel 2005 and um, it's uh, gone very gone under undergone various updates over the years and th these sort of latest engines are very very reliable and they're still used today actually that that engine um, because it's a fantastic engine um, you know very powerful very smooth uh, economical uh, for a three liter diesel and um, yeah, nothing much else to say about that, just as you'd expect with Mercedes, reliable and trouble free. So if you have any questions, you can always contact us, um, 02476 386 email sales at merclan.com, message us through the website, um, send us a letter, send us a message, however you want to get in contact, we'll be here for you. Thank you very much.